What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Barry Tone. In today's video, I'm going to be showcasing guys basically where to locate your save file on the Xenia emulator. But before we get started this video, please make sure guys you like, share, and also subscribe if you guys are new to the channel because it greatly keep, um, helps out the channel a lot. Without further ado, let's get right into it. Let's get it. Alrighty, first things first, for you guys to basically um, find your save files, I suggest you guys basically getting Notepad++, which I'll leave in the description down below. This is basically, you download this to basically enhance um, your, your regular Notepad to basically more advanced. So for me, since my I run at a 64-bit computer, I'm going to install for 64. If you guys have 32-bit, obviously you're going to get um, for 32-bit. And how this basically works is when you open up your Xenia folder, make sure if you're using, uh, if you open up your Xenia through a RAR, RAR file, I suggest you guys making your own folder and then drag and drop your files into a, a folder. Now here, as you can see here, as you guys may know, when you open up the Xenia emulator, you're gonna, you usually, you're used to seeing three um, applications, Xenia, um, a notepad for Xenia and also this. But do keep in mind when you're having Notepad Plus Plus for the first time, you're gonna left click, go to new, go to your text document, and you're gonna make a new folder. Um, you're not gonna make a new folder, you're gonna make a new text document called portable, like you see where I did right here. You're basically gonna call it portable. And after that, when you when you make port um, a new text document called Portable, you're gonna basically close the folder, open up the folder again, open up um, the Xenia emulator, and whatever game you're playing, like say for example it's Red Dead or something like Naruto Broken Bond, uh, when you're playing those games for the first time, and then you're gonna save it for the very first time. The Xenia emulator is automatically going to make a new folder for you the first time you save the game after you make the portable text document. After you do that, you're obviously going to close it, close uh, out the folder, and then boom, a folder should ca uh, called contact should appear. And when you go on, click on contact, I mean, double click on contact, this is where you're going to have your save file. So, like, say, for example, if you want to share saves with different people or use somebody else's saves or edit your saves or mod your saves. This is how, where you basically find your save, lo um, save location for any game you're playing on the Zenny emulator. It's pretty simple and easy, straight to the point. Like I said, it's not too difficult. So yeah, that's basically about it. If you guys enjoyed this video, feel free to like, share, and also subscribe if you guys are new. And yeah, but guys, this is your boy Bray, so I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.